Hi guys, welcome to the channel. The car that you see here today is the 6 series GT. This car was first introduced in 1976 with the first generation. Uh, this car currently that you see here is in its fourth generation. The car was initially launched in 2018. However, this is the facelift version which was launched in uh, 2022. And this is the M Sport variant. Of course, we see a lot of uh, sportiness in the front bumper and the rear bumper uh, with the M Sport package. The aprons are quite uh, sharp, you know, with a lot of air vents across. Adaptive headlamps in the front. Adaptive BMW headlamps. We also have the active airstream kidney grill. So this is uh, a Grand Tourer. One of the most comfortable cars to drive as well as uh, sit and relax at if the car is being chauffeur driven as well. So this being a M Sport package, we have a lot of elements like the high gloss black elements in the front bumper. We have the M alloy. This car also comes with a mix set of tires with the 245 in the front and 275 at the rear. Also has four piston M brakes. This car is basically built on a 7 series platform. So it gets a very good wheelbase. So let me show you the exterior. Spoiler which will uh, retract and open when uh, the car exceeds speed of 110 kilometers per hour or 70 kilometers per hour trapezoidal design tailpipes as a part of m sport of course the uh, cerium gray is also a part of m sport package so the rear diffuser design with the free flow form exhaust tail pipes six hundred plus liters of boot space and the boot opens quite big of course there is a spare wheel in case of any emergency the tray can also be open. This is the rear view. We see that the high gloss black is also a part of M Sport package, black on the B pillar as well. Let me show you the exterior. Coming to the interior, a frameless doors gives unique look, adds a lot of style to the exterior. We have a double stitch to give more premium feel which flows across a double seam which flows from the door connects to the dashboard. We see that there's a lot of stitch as well in the dash. Excellent uh, wood finish in high gloss. We have ambient lights. This car also comes with a four zone climate control, 
air conditioning with a touch operating system this is a i drive 7 so currently all the cars have i drive 8 with all the new generation with the configurable widgets steering is a m sport steering wheel quite comfortable to hold we have limiter and cruise control options we have uh, communication call personal assistant paddle shifts adaptive high beam assistant so nothing has changed much on the interior uh, from the car since it was launched in 2018 the car also comes standard with the air suspension so that the car can be raised for 20 mm and the car will lower itself when the speeds are exceeding 140 km per hour uh, excellent leather the touch and feel is quite good have some space here as all the m sport variants the the headliner is anthracite let me get into the second row seats So this car has a 16 speaker Harman Kardon system also comes with the rear screen entertainment just in case. We also have provision of HDMI connectivity. So in case if there is a HDMI it will also appear here and then because anybody can connect the this is oh, here is a HDMI they can connect any input device like a fire stick to watch or if there are any blu-ray disc players blu-ray disc it can be played with this blu-ray disc player so the controls for the fourth zone third zone and the fourth zone air conditioning we have type c charges at the rear we also have one 12 volt socket just in case if somebody wants to connect or power so we have two rear screen entertainment so we can view the navigation in case if there is any navigation or currently connected apps are not available for 6 series in India hence uh, few options the phone can be connected to listen to audio or we also have a headphone which can be connected with the 3.5 mm jack or uh, optional bluetooth headphones provided by bmw it's quite comfortable considering the enormous legroom that the car has to offer excellent seating uh, even the re reclining position is quite comfortable for this six you can also fold the seats we also have a provision in case if somebody has to access the boot we can fold this and access the rear boot over here also all the seats can be folded in case if somebody is interested to extend the space that's pretty much what the car has to offer it's an excellent uh, car to be driven or to drive considering the dynamics that the car has to offer comes basically with the 2 litre petrol and the 2 litre diesel engine this is all about the 6 series GT thank you